I'm Eloise Dietz, I'm a 17 and I'm from Hanover, New Hampshire. I'm Stephen Jenkins, I'm a dual degree student from Colby College. I'm from West Lebanon, New Hampshire. Over the summer I'm working with a dual degree student for Professor Ray to make one of her labs more accessible to other colleges. I've always been interested in combining mechanical and electrical pieces of projects together. I liked both subjects in my engineering studies and so I think robotics is the perfect combination of the two for me. My research has been mostly in creating these robots that we will send out to other colleges and abroad so that students can run through control theory labs on their own without having to be in Dartmouth taking the class. Students take robot cars and control them to stay a certain distance away from a surface and also to keep a pendulum standing up. My day-to-day -day operation has been building six of these robots up that we will send off to the students. I really wanted to be able to do some more hands-on work over the summer. So far I've learned a lot about machining. I've spent most of my time in the machine shop and I, at the beginning of the summer I didn't even know what a mill was so it was really cool being able to learn how to use it. I have been working on both the mechanical processes, so in the machine shop, using the mill and the lathe uh, to construct the mechanical pieces of the robot, and then also ordering a bunch of electrical components and soldering them together and designing a little bit of the circuitry that goes into the cars. A lot of things now are being spread online, education-wise, but with engineering that's really hard because I think it needs to be hands-on in order to learn. So. This lab in a suitcase idea is allowing her to spread this lab to other colleges with an online aspect as well as having the hands-on part that I think is really important for engineering. 